Hello, Darius. Hey, hey, Rena. Do you like the house I made for you? You know I love you, right? Uh, yeah. Don't take this the wrong way, but the house is horrible. Uh, yeah, I know. The sad part is, I tried my best. Well, Darius, you know, it could be worse. Everything could be worse. Could it? Because everything we know and love is gone. We are the last ones left, Darius. It could be worse if you were not alongside me. Yeah, you're right. I'm glad I have you, Darius. So, where exactly is it that you're staying? That I'm... Uh, I'm not gonna tell you. What? Why not? Don't worry about it. Just know if you ever need me, I'm within arm's reach. I'll always need you, Darius. As I'll always need you. But that's what I'm afraid of. Huh? Don't worry about it. Here, I'll let you get settled in. Darius, come back! Everything's different, but Darius is still the same. It's so peaceful. It's hard to think that there are no humans left in the whole world. Huh? Did Darius leave me a note? Rena, remember the temple I told you about? I scribbled down the directions on this piece of paper. I suggest you go and check it out. <sighs> we grew up together, and yet Darius still avoids interacting with me. So much for love. Now, to find this temple... So this, this is the temple. So, these are the stones of life? Every one of these stones holds a living person. And when the time comes, it's my job to bring them out. But what I don't understand is why I can't just bring these people out of the stones right now. Everyone died, but these people? I can bring them back. So, why not? Rena, don't worry about it. Just know that that's not the way the Stones of Life work. You claim to know so much, but yet you tell me nothing. I have my reasons. I'm so tired of all the secrets. Everyone on Earth is dead and gone. All that's left is you and I. And yet you still can't tell me anything. Rena, I, I just need you to trust me. Trust can only go so far, Darius. Especially when you expect it to be one-sided. 